No, you're not going to have all those modes and all those ideas and things like that. You're going to have to practice. And, you know, playing the thing up and down is good, but we, you need to do some different intervals to create phrases. So I recommend, you know, things like playing four note pattern, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. One of these, you could play this one backwards instead of doing one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. You could do four, three, two, one. You understand? Or you could do thirds, for instance. Or you could play those thirds backwards instead of doing one, three, one, three, I'm doing three, one. Okay? Or you, know, you could do different numbers. You could play, you could put two exercises at the same time. I could go up and the next one go down. And all these little exercises are going to give you the opportunity when you play phrase, you know, play a solo, to create phrases or even bass line. If I just for instance, play, try to play a solo, you know, in the G7, as I did before, so I'm going to use the same idea, you know. I'm going to be able to, I'm going to be able to play the phrase straight, but if, to make it more interesting, I can do playing thirds. Then I can change the rhythm playing the same thirds. I could do... You see, if I change the speed, the different speed between the notes, then I create a phrase using exactly the same pattern. I could add four notes. Four notes. Put little thirds. With it, there we go. I have a phrase. You see, little thirds going down and little four notes together, that creates phrases. So the idea is to practice all your modes like that. You're going to play, you know, your thirds on the Dorian pattern. Keep going with the position. Play the four notes, etc., etc. So I gave you uh, on that lesson a bunch of combinations. You could find other ones. We did, for instance, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. You could do one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, four. Or you could do one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay? So you can invent your own thing, but uh, usually I recommend people to just follow my exercise. If you can do these, you usually can do the other one easier. You know, so don't try to practice thousand exercises at the same time. Just try to master a couple of them, and then you learn new ones. It's better.